It's Sunday and it's half past five in the morning. What am I doing awake? Good morning guys, how are you all doing? Wow, it's been that long since I've vlogged, I've forgotten how to start. <laughs> yes, it is currently 5.30 a.m. As some of you may be aware, all week I've been doing 12 hour days. That means getting up at 5 a.m., being at work at 6 till 6. And I've literally come straight home, sat in front of the TV, had some food, and then about half past nine, just going to bed. So basically I've been doing nothing other than work. And yesterday I was planning on vlogging, but I got out of bed at 6 a.m. because I want to stay on the same shift pattern for next week because yet again I'm on 12 hour days. Hi dude. <laughs> My original plan for yesterday was I was gonna go downtown in the morning on a bus and go from one end to the other shopping and then eventually go to the Asda to come home. But I was that worn out from all those 12 hours that I did that I basically just got in the car, went to the comic shop, popped into TJU's on a whim, found a raincoat. Finally, I found a thin raincoat that I've been after. I'll show that later, I think. And then I went to the Asda and then I went home and basically did nothing for the rest of the day although i had to recreate one of my earlier dvds my smeg chris volume three i've been watching it and i think episode 11 10 it just started sticking so i've had to redo a new one and that took some effort because there were some like unleashed episodes that i had to put on as bonus and yada yada Noisy crow, shush. But today, because I'm off to a market, I thought I'd bring the camera with me. Because I'm most likely not going to be vlogging all of the following week either. Oh, and talking of smeg, Chris, I've not been able to make any videos because I get home, like I say, I'm too tired, worn out. I just can't be bothered. I've got, a, I'm not saying it's a script, I've got bullet points for a, a smeg, Chris review to do. Just haven't had the energy. I'm surprised I've got energy to walk in around the field right now. And the reason my hood's up is because it's drizzling. I'm hoping that's going to stop. Otherwise it's not going to be much of a market. Now at the market with a Jojo <laughs> and a, a very sleepy archer who's in the pram. My cousin Jess was supposed to be here with the baby as well but apparently the baby's been up all night so they've decided to not come with us. We might see them later. And the drizzle has stopped. The sun is trying to come out. But there's actually quite a few stalls here at the market. I'm just realising I've left Joe behind. <laughs> She's down there. Look at Archie just napping. You going back to sleep? Is it too early for him? Had a busy day. He's had busy last month. He's been on two holidays. I thought that was a real horse then. <laughs> what am I like? There really is a lot of stalls today. Look at this lot. The sun's still setting up. By the way, I forgot to point out, this is my new coat that I was talking about. One of these. It's quite comfortable. The hood only comes to about here. So that's good. And it tucks away in the back as well. The only thing it doesn't have are any inside pockets, but that's fine. The zip up ones on the sides. Oh, and Archie's woken up because he's found a toy he wanted. Hopefully I'm going to buy something as well. well I finally bought something. <laughs> a sandwich. Somebody's bought a lot of things. Haven't you? Some more chicken as well. Anybody think it was Christmas again? <laughs> oh, what? I think the uh, sun's about to come out. I might have to take this coat off in a bit. I think I'm going to enjoy this. So we're walking around and look who's got a stall. Where's he gone? <laughs> he keeps running off. John, Joe's brother. Showing uh, Archie some of the stuff he's got. Archie's got enough. I know, just say I'm just watching John's selling skills. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> yep, so are you. <laughs> On, I still bought nothing, I'm surprised. Can't say the same about him, what, he's bought another item? I don't know. 
I was getting worried. I thought I was going to go around the entire market without buying anything. Finally, I've got something. <laughs> Only eight pounds. Thing is, I sent off for one the other day from Amazon. Not this one, obviously. My collection's growing. Well, I've had to put my coat on and put the hood up because it started raining. <sighs> if you've noticed, people are starting to pack up. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, at least I can give my coat a test. <laughs> it's now stopped raining, so I've been able to take my coat off. And we're about to leave. As you can see, a lot of other people are doing so as well. Didn't really buy as much as I thought I would, but never mind. At least I got that action figure. I'm happy about that. But uh, that raincoat did really well. I'm nice and dry. I'm glad I bought it. Anyway, it's now 25 to 12. What my neck. <laughs> Which means it's time to go. Just got home, it's already 25 past four. We went to John's house, spent, I don't know, an hour, an hour and a half there, just pottering her about, having a coffee, falling asleep. <laughs> and then we were going to see Jess, but I've been in contact with her and uh, she's not feeling very well, the baby's not feeling very well, so we said, okay, fine, we'll leave. And then I went to Joe's house and had another coffee there and now I've just got home and the funny thing is Amazon have been to deliver something in this package it just so happens to be another one of these but I'll not get it out just yet because Harley needs to go for a walk I think he's desperate <sighs> Harley's now walked so I thought I'd show you what I've got through the post in fact before I do I should show you something John gave me. As they were packing up their market stall they decided to just like give away stuff and I was curious about this thing it's um, well apparently attaches to the bike the bicycle needs a bit of a clean but I'll give it a try see if it's any good and he also gave me this wristband thing and of course yeah I spotted that and I had to have it. The item that I sent off for is well, funnily enough, that's Black Canary. I now have White Canary as well. <laughs> I wanted one from Legends of Tomorrow. And it was either this or the Atom. So I thought, why not get it? Oh yeah, there's one other thing I want to say before I sign off. You remember the crazy deal that I got with my e package, you know, the mobile, the broadband, and I ended up with a free watch. I'm actually getting another free item for rejoining BT on the hub. Crazy, crazy deal. Because I joined BT, they gave me the offer of three items. One was uh, an Amazon Echo. I'm not really that bothered. Some light bulbs that you can turn on through your phone, I guess. Again, not bothered. But the other thing, and I've been looking at them for a long time, is a soundbar for the TV. So I sent for that and it's worth £149. So I've got roughly, including this, £400 worth of stuff for nothing, for just resorting out my deal. How does that work? <laughs> you know what it is? They're all mental. These people who have these phone companies, they're mental. Anyway, I am now going to go. It's now time for me to say thank you for watching and subscribing if you have and liking this video if you did. Until the next time, peace out. You know I have to do it, don't you? <laughs>